Hey guys, and welcome back. For today's video, I'm going to be walking you through a step-by-step -step guide on how to set up your Google Chromecast device to your television and also how to hook it up with your smartphone. So the first thing we're going to do is just hook everything up and make sure we have all the right pieces. So we have this USB power adapter that we're going to plug into the wall, and then we're going to plug one end of the USB power cord into that power adapter. And then we go over to the other end of the power line, and that's going to be plugged in to our Chromecast device itself. And then also we're going to plug the Google Chromecast into one of our HDMI ports on the back of our television. Make sure you know which HDMI port you're hooking into. For me, it's HDMI 1. If you know exactly which port that you're hooked into, it's going to make things a little bit easier when we try to find that port on our television. So for me, with my smart TV, it's really easy to find HDMI 1. So I'm going to select that. If you have a more traditional television, you're still going to need to bring out your remote and figure out how to change the source to HDMI 1 because that's where we're going to be casting to. So once we have everything hooked up, ready to go, now we need to take on the next step, which is hooking our smartphone device to the Google Chromecast so we can cast that video content. So over on our phone, I'm using an Android device. You need to make sure that you have Google Home, the application, installed and downloaded. If you don't have it, you can get that from the Google Play Store, and it's also available from the Apple App Store if you have an iPhone. So we're going to launch this, log in to your Google account. And then once you're in Google Home logged into your Google account, we're going to click set up device. And then we need to click which room that this device or which house or area that this device is going to be hooked into. For me, it's called home. So now it's looking for devices. This might take a little bit of time, but eventually it finds my Google Chromecast. So we're going to click connect to that with the next step. So it's connecting to our Chromecast. And again, this might take a little bit of time, but eventually it should say connected. Then it should pop up with a code on your TV. And for me, I need to make sure that I'm in HDMI 1 because that is where my Chromecast is hooked into. But make sure the code on your device, your smartphone, is the same code that you're seeing on your television. When that's the case, we can go on and move to the next step. And then it says, do you want to help improve Chromecast? It's up to you. If you want to do that, I said yes, that I'll do that for them. And then we need to mark which room that our Chromecast device is in. For me, it's the living room. And then which internet connection that we're going to be hooked into. And then we're going to click OK on having it save our password. And then it's going to connect to Wi-Fi at this point. And again, that might take a little bit of time, but eventually it'll say connected. And then linking your Chromecast account, we want it to do that. So we're going to click the Next option. And stay in the know. This is totally up to you if you want to sign up for that or not. I did no. And then it's going to ask you if you want to add some of your favorite video services, such as Netflix and some of these other options that they give you. So if you want to do that, just go ahead and click on the service and you can log in to your account to get everything set up. But I'm just going to skip past this for now. All of the different video services you're going to be having on your phone and then when you go into those video services, we're going to cast them to the Chromecast and it'll show up on our television. But at this point, it says we're all done. So we're going to click continue. And once everything is done and set up, it's going to update the Chromecast. And this will take a little bit of time. But then after it's done updating, it should be ready to use and go. So we're going to click continue. And after we click continue, it's going to just walk us through a really simple tutorial it's going to give you different clips and options that you can do so it'll walk you through this tutorial i clicked on hbo now you can see in the upper right hand corner there's that little cast button and whichever video application you're in you might be able to find that cast button that means it is compatible with google chromecast and it means that you're able to click that and it'll cast it over to your television and if you want to change the volume up and down you can simply do that by clicking the volume up and down buttons on your smartphone and that's pretty much going to wrap up this tutorial and be towards the end of this video. Again, guys, all of your different video applications on your phone, more than likely, if they're a major application, they should be compatible with Google Chromecast. You can launch it, watch video content, click the cast button, and it should go over to your television. So that's going to wrap this one up. Thanks for stopping on in. Subscribe for more, and I hope to see you back here for future videos.